welcome back to my channel presence of a goddess thank you guys for joining me today today is just going to be a quick message for the air signs so if it resonates awesome i appreciate if you subscribe like and share it also you think it resonate too i do appreciate you and if you want to book a personal reading with me the information is down below stay tapped in with your girl for uh, updates on the community boards um also if you want to donate to the channel it is highly appreciated i have the heart button in the cash app down below uh thank you guys for supporting me and let's continue to keep glowing and growing i love you guys um and i'm seeing you love peace and blessings okay so we're gonna do something a little different today uh but let's get into it okay what do we have for my gemini libra and aquarius for spiritual what do you mean spiritual peace right peace imagination so might could be a gemini have pisces placements and loneliness okay scorpio placements adversity humor all right you have to laugh maybe you've been laughing through the pain here um, it's not uncommon because feeling that energy here, so it's like you're laughing to keep from crying here. Um, something that you wished for did not come true in or something, or it's like, I'm hearing it's lonely at the top. So you could be feeling lonely the more you rise up here, but I feel like it's because, um, so first of all, somebody's coming up to the top with you. So, okay. Let's be, let's, let's get that straight. Somebody going to be there already when you at the top, when you, when you climb a little more. Don't think that you're just stopping at this destination and you're not. Because you're manifesting and your manifestations is coming in steps. Because like I always tell y'all, the journey that we're on is meant for character building and for us to learn. So the more you learn, the more you are, you're rising up, you're elevating, okay? Spiritually, you're elevating. I feel like you're finding peace, but the thing is, you could have been suffering from some codependency issues, and I feel like you're releasing that now, but it kind of feels odd because you're so used to, like, having people around, all right? But I feel like you're releasing that. Some of you guys are already at that stage where you're used to just chilling by yourself. You could have Aquarius energy, um, but I feel like something now, I feel like now that you're at the top or you're elevating, you're starting to miss people. Okay, you could even be celibate. Now you're now you're having sexual urges. Now you're like fantasizing. And I feel like um but you're at peace with yourself though. I just feel like sometimes you just get a little lonely. Get a little lonely at the top. That's one here. But the world is still gonna go around and I feel like you're starting to learn that like no matter what the world is gonna go around, so you have to keep a continue to manifest and continue to work towards your goals and i feel like that's what you're doing um and that's what you need to continue to do here and just laugh here and i know that um laughter ain't gonna just but when you are at a high vibration or when you're trying to stay optimistic that's effort you're showing the universe you're grateful you're showing the universe that um you appreciate the small things in life even if it is just laughter okay we have to appreciate the small things as well as the big things here um you could be purchasing something Okay, you could be purchasing something or you per like you're going shopping or you're window shopping, but maybe you're realizing like, yeah, I like nice things, but I also want that intimacy. So you're yearning for intimacy here. I see a relationship that's purposeful, okay? Because I feel like you were around a lot of people that you just didn't, you wasn't really mingling with, you wasn't really clicking with, and I feel like you don't like, um, connections that are not meaningful and people don't understand it they think you're being a little off-putting but i feel like you're just not going to fake the funk for anyone have you any aquarius energy libra as well like you're keeping it real all right i feel like you're starting to learn how to get your ducks in a row when it comes with your mind being everywhere or when you always having to be around people i feel like that that stage of your life is over i just feel like you just want a meaningful relationship someone you can actually connect with and not just idle with because you know when you're around some people you're idling you're just like wasting your time it's like no you want to build something you want to learn from this person and vice versa so yeah that's what i'm getting here and i feel like um spirit is about to give you that and this is why you're yearning you're manifesting this and it's coming in a fast in a fast pace now because you're at a level where you have learned to um enjoy your own company but now um you're gonna be with someone but i feel like also remember when you are with someone or when you do build this new tribe that's coming in why is my necklace okay when you are building this tribe that that is coming in also 
balance here you don't always have to be around them you don't always have to talk to them every day you know what i'm saying sometimes you need some new time to recuperate okay um that's what i'm getting here so let's see here let's see what business here business purpose all that okay career for my air signs gemini libras and my aquarius yeah, we have children, your inner child here, study. You could be working with children or you're really good with children. Children loves you here. Or you helping other people heal their inner child here. You could be studying some type of psychology or sociology here. Or maybe this is what you're led to do is help people. Yeah, you're on the right path and whatever you're doing. Something that's family oriented. Um, you could have like a family business here or you're creating something that helps families here in a way. All right, you're helping to heal families, breaking generational curses within your your own family here some of you guys could be guided to work at a school or something or to do reiki healing with family or with children all right that's what i'm seeing or you're just healing people inner child if it's not actual children but you're on the right path here um you have a lot of options here you could be like yeah that's what i'm saying like your mind is everywhere but you're starting to realize um getting your ducks in a row so when it comes to what you want to do you're starting to realize i can do it all but you have to have a plan so it's like you're you're getting a plan here spirit is definitely giving you a lot of ideas because maybe in your past life some of you guys had um work with children here okay that's what i'm seeing here yeah flowers you're receiving your flowers here a lot of people a lot of people love you you're very protected in this tribe or in this spirit game because you are doing something that's helping others here leadership you're taking leadership all right you, like i said you're going to the next level so some of you guys are becoming high ranked earth angels um where you're helping a lot of people um you're healing the earth okay that's what i'm getting here yeah because you're very strong you're strong to do this who else can do it but you, baby? Because you're strong. Okay, Leo placements here. Yeah, you're helping the environment. Um, also, you you could be the type of person like you like to recycle or you like to pick up litter, uh, cleaning the earth here. Mother guy, I really appreciate that. Um, also, have some of you guys could be guided to write a book or to express yourself creatively. Also, as well, because music. Okay, I'm getting music or poetry. Really like um your ancestors like when you sing or when you express yourself through like art okay they be sitting there like mm, my baby girl know how to sing my baby boy my baby boy is an artist yeah they like talking to you look your angels like talking to you continue to talk to your angels through music or they're, they're communicating with you through music they're communicating you through through your mind so the stuff you be expressing they're like talking to you okay so some of you guys could be guided to just like show your arts and stuff to other people because like your music could be changing some of you guys are like artists your music could be changing um people's like your help healing them through music okay or through poetry or through something expressive okay through um instruments for some of you guys so let's get into it with your love i had kept it too long i don't want to do it too long for y'all because um i have things to do but <laughs> let's get into it yeah, the star card, Aquarius energy, Aquarius and a half, the tower. You had a tower moment, but it was only to bring healing to you, bring healing and understanding to bring abundance as well. Yeah, an inheritance coming in with the King of Pentacles. Somebody coming in, you broke up with someone here who was um unraveling your healing. Because like I told you, maybe somebody was like trauma bonding with you. Okay, yeah, somebody was trauma bonding and a lot of codependency holding you back here. You got fire sign placements. Eight of Pentacles, King of Pentacles, the Emperor was upside down. Yeah, somebody was a false, a false one here. But they portray like they were the real one here. But you see someone clear as day now. Yeah, you see something clear as day. I feel like somebody's about to give you the love of your dreams here. They like your spiciness. They like how um how honest you are okay this person could be very honest themselves they could be a libra you could be a libra or somebody's a leo somebody's about to ask you out on a date and then it's going to turn into um forever all right my love is about to turn in forever here they're going to wipe you up and you guys are going to have a ever everly happy a happily ever after here because something is over with someone who did not appreciate you or was trauma bonding and trying to hold you back and trying to remind you of your trauma like remember when i helped you do this remember you didn't have nothing when i had so somebody was definitely trying to 
belittle you and make you feel insecure. And I feel like that is over now. You're about to be with someone who is very patient with you and loving and not all that drama. But somebody really wanted to portray like they were the one for you because they just wanted to hold you back. They, I don't know, they have some vendetta against the opposite sex here. Okay, maybe they have father, daddy issues or mother issues. That's what I'm getting here as well. Somebody could be a Scorpio or a Leo or a Libra in a, or a Taurus here. But you know your worth here. And I feel like you're going towards what makes you happy. Or you're celebrated, baby, not tolerated. Okay? Yeah, something is being laid to rest here. Okay? Yeah. Somebody could be going to, going to a funeral or RIP to the old you, baby. I feel like you're a whole new person. you about to have a baby shower or a wedding here. Somebody's about to get married to you. All right? Yeah, this is happening very fast. So, particularly. Protect your energy from people who bring drama. Don't accept offers. Don't accept offers. I keep saying offers. So something often happens to you where you always bump it into these karmics here. But spirits is saying that um there's a test coming in or you already passed the test where you're not accepting offers where people are treating you like dirt here. Okay, anymore. So if you let somebody go in a quickie, um, yeah, this was a swift relationship or this was a swift ending here where you said, no, you're not going to treat me like dirt. You're not going to trauma bond with me and make me feel insecure about my past. And I feel like um, you're putting yourself first and that's where you, you want when you celebrate and not celebrate. That's what I'm getting here. I mean, period. What else can I say? And you will be celebrated, baby. Somebody wants to wipe you down here because you have healed. And I feel like when this abrupt ending happened or when you do do this, you're going to be looking like, wow, somebody could be traveling. But you're going to be looking like, wow, I really am healed because I'm not putting up what I used to put up with. Yeah, VIP. You want a VIP, baby. You passed the test. Drop dead gorgeous. And you drop dead gorgeous. And you're about to be celebrated. People are about to rally around you because you're different. You're very innovative. And your energy here, okay? Yeah, definitely fire sign meeting. You might want to check out your health as well. So, yeah, take care of your health here. Speaking up for yourself. Gemini energy, like I said. And Oya. Okay, things are changing. Big change. Big step up. Yeah, move your body. You could be moving a lot here. Moving your body. You have a lot of energy here. Because, um... Um, I'm getting fire breathing. You could be fire breathing or you're doing some type of hoodoo or voodoo or you could be Haitian or you're like engaging into spirituality a lot more. Like you're deep in it where you know things. You just know, okay? It's like your ancestors cherish you, okay? Yeah, you have a lot of spiritual gifts. Like I say, you can communicate the spirit in different ways here and you can understand them. Yeah, somebody's going to be sprung over you, and you're going to be independent. You're independent, okay, baby? I want you. I don't need you, okay? And it's like, you're not going to sit here and try to make it seem like um, I'm on your I'm on your butt. I'm on your dick. Like, no, I'm not on your dick, baby, okay? You need me more than I need you because somebody is really trying to make it seem like you need them here, okay? Somebody, but low-key, they will sprung over you, okay? So let me get a charm here. We good to go. Yeah, we have out. Yeah, you have become very wise. I told you. You become very wise. You learn the lessons. You learn you learned your worth here and you're not doing the things that you used to do. Heavy on spiritual wisdom here. Okay, you could be wearing a lot of purple, but spirit is with you. So yeah, stay tapped in, baby. All right, air signs. I hope this resonated with you. You know what to do.